dreams without goals is delusion. Dreams without action, you have goals, then you've got to act on those goals. Dreams without any of that stuff is just delusion. You're just sitting around wishing for something to happen. People can be in a bad place, obviously. You know, if you've lost someone really close to you or you've been betrayed or you've been hurt or you've been through some sort of trauma, this depressed state can last a long time, of course. But do not live there. Do not believe that because you have depression now, that means that's who you are. Don't label yourself as depressed. Know that you can get out of it. There's a way out. There is light at the end of the darkness, but you have to look for it. Now, suddenly, everyone's comparing themselves to everyone else, and it people's heads, and it gets people down. People are happy living life doing something they hate. There's a lot of people in this world, the highlight of their day is going in the toilet and having a shit so they can play uh, Angry Birds for <laughs> 10 minutes while they have a poo, so they can get away from their job that they're in. If you know it's something you don't want to do for the rest of your life, then you've always got to be on the lookout at least for something else and don't close off the possibility that you could do something else. Otherwise, it, uh, literally, before you know it, you're going to be 70 years old and you've, been, you've spent your life on that toilet. Too many of us go through life living like we have all the time in the world and we take for granted everything around us. All of the possibilities, all of the opportunities, all of the people who love us. We just take it all for granted. The fact that you're gonna die should light a fire under your eyes and get you to start seeing the world differently. You cannot beat the enemy within, you can only tame it. You can only make sure you work on your mind like a muscle in the gym so you remain bigger and stronger than it. But that enemy within will always be there circling in that cage, staring at you, waiting, silently waiting for you to slip up. So keep it in check, work on yourself daily, and never give in. I will never surrender. Weakness will not be in my heart. I understand victory, and I understand never surrendering. Because no matter how bad things go, my heart and my mind will carry my body when my limbs are too weak. No one will deny me. No one will define me. And no one will tell me who and what I am and can be. Thanks for watching this video, guys. Listen, if you want more motivational fire coming to you every single week, then subscribe to my channel right here. If you don't know why you should subscribe yet and you need a little bit more convincing, watch my next video right here. Thanks for watching.